Hi, I'm Callie Chunstudy. I'm the curator for the Cherokee Heritage Center. Today I'm going to show you two different styles of tying a Cherokee turban. One is the style like you see here on Chief Spring Frog, and the other is the style like you would see in depictions of Sequoia, the inventor of our syllabary. This is the style that you see on Sequoia. It's a very simple <coughs> wrap. This turban was made by Tanya Weevil, Cherokee National Treasure. Now, as you can see, it's kind of like a really long pillowcase, closed at one end, made of long swaths of fabric, and it can be made out of all sorts of types of fabric. This is my lovely assistant. You would put the end of the pillowcase around the forehead. Tighten it as you need in the back and just start twisting the fabric, pulling that around. Oh, there was my papers. Twisting it as you rotate it around the forehead. Just continue this wrap all the way around the forehead. keeping it snug and as you twist it you can show the different parts of the fabric when you get to the end of the fabric you just tuck it down inside nice and snug like that pull it up off of the eyes and that is how you do a Cherokee turban no one really knows where exactly we picked up the turban there are a lot of rumors but Cherokees were very fashionable and loved to pick up other, uh, other types of fashions from the different cultures that were migrating into America, and so this was likely picked up from some of the traders that they encountered. The second version is just a square piece of fabric. This one is fringy. You fold it diagonally. And it's kind of in the fashion of a woman's headscarf. You drape the straight edge around the back of the head. You pull this around, tie it in the front. Bring this part up. And tie it again. You can tuck it in leave parts of it uh, <clears throat> dangling down but these are your two types of Cherokee turbans. I hope you enjoyed this video.